guys, this is Maji from Maji Toots. Today I would like to show you how you can um, how you can make tables in a nice way in WordPress instead of using the standard um, tables uh, functionality of WordPress, which is okay for very simple tables, but once it gets a little bit more complex, you will definitely want to have a nice plugin to handle that for you. So let's have a look at that. Um, our plugin is called table press it's very awesome it's free you can get it from within your wordpress just go to plugins here on the left side go to add new type in table press here on the right side and there you go this is the plugin by tobias betke um, Awesome plugin, free as I just mentioned before. Almost a million active installations, so that says quite a lot. Um, in my in my um, case here, there seems to be a conflict because I didn't update my WordPress version, but that doesn't really matter. It still works very very well. Um, from here, you will be able to install it. Just click here. There, you will have like a button here, install now, just as all the other plugins here have. After you've installed it from, from here, you can also activate the plugin. And um, once you've done that, uh, on the left side, you will have uh, a link here to your plugin, just as I have here. So let me quickly show how that um, plugin is actually look uh, actually looks like on a on a website. Uh, okay, let me. Oh, this is one of my um, websites here. Carry on baggage um, is talking about um, traveling, and yeah, I don't want to go in, into detail here for the moment. Thing is, here I have a nice little table, and this is actually. Uh, table press um, table. Uh, the cool thing is that this plugin uh, looks very nice and it's responsive. It's also gonna look like look nice on mobile device, which is very important. Uh, it's fully customizable. You can change the colors um, of the rows um, of the titles here. Uh, you, you can even insert a nice little search functionality like a search bar will appear here and people will be able to search within your table for a huge table like this one here that's going to be very um, useful well if you know mac a little bit you can also just click command and f and i can search for easyjet for example bam and you will have the result uh, immediately or i can type in ryanair and it's going to switch to the right column very fast which is cool so you might wonder how, how is this gonna look like uh, on a mobile device. Um, to check that we can just use the inspector of Google Chrome, right click on the table or somewhere else in the post, uh, go to inspect. There on top of the screen you can actually choose the different kinds of devices uh, to preview the, how it will display on those devices which is a very nice feature. Um, let's say we want to know an iPhone 6, 7, 8, how this is going to look like. Um, sometimes you, you want to, to refresh the page to make sure that everything um, displays accordingly. And now you can see that the table here looks like this. Well, yeah, you think you probably think it's cut off. Yeah, it is, because how is it possible to display that much information on such a small, such a small, small display? Well, it's not possible to display everything at the same time, but this plugin will allow you horizontal scrolling and um, you can just browse through the information horizontally with your finger. If you're on an iPhone, it's, it's, go it's still going to be very accessible and people will, will be able to see all the information. If you're gonna do a table like this in the standard tables functionality on WordPress, then good luck. It's gonna be a nightmare on mobile devices. It's not gonna, it's not gonna look nice at all. So there you go. Um, that's a table pl table press plugin. Uh, just one more thing I want I want to to mention is. Um, 
to make the horizontal scrolling work, you will actually need to also install um, an extension to the plugin. And you can do that in WordPress. Um, let me just quickly see what that extension is called like, because I'm not sure anymore. Um, table press extension responsive tables. As far as I know, you won't find this in the WordPress repository here directly in WordPress. So what you want to do is um, you want to search for that on Google. And there you will find it, um, table press extensions here from the official website of um, the creator of the plugin. And there you can actually download it um, from there and install it into WordPress. You will need this because if you don't do that, your tables won't be uh, responsive uh, out of the box. But um, the extent, it's a premium extension, but it's actually free. But you can donate something to the guy, uh, which would be nice if you do that because it's an amazing plugin and it definitely took some work to, to get that plugin going. Um, yeah, what else can I say about that? Uh, yeah, maybe let's have a look uh, in, in the back end how, how this table, how you can actually create a table. So what you need to do is you can go to table press here on the left side, click the link, then go to add new table. And there, and then you will have a, a very simple input mask here. Just type in uh, a name for your table, how many rows and columns you would like to have. Uh, don't worry too much about that. It's very easy to add and delete columns and rows uh, later on. So for now we will just create five rows and five columns. There you go. And now you can just input your data, like let's say usually the first um, row is um, the, the heading of the table. You can just uh, write something, a small test, and here I can input some data, whatever. And then you have a lot of customization features here. You can easily add uh, and delete rows and columns. Um, you can uh, decide if you want to show the table name or not. And then if you have the, the extension that I mentioned before, you will have more options like here. And for example, here, the last one, you will be able to um, to activate that horizontal scrolling so that um, the tables will still fully be viewable on mobile devices. There are also other options you have for responsive design in mobile that are offered by table press. Uh, but I, I, I like the horizontal scrolling. It's very easy to, to use on mobile device with the finger. You can just scroll horizontally. Um, I think that works really well. And another cool feature is you can preview your tables before you actually publish, uh, I mean before before even importing them into your post, you can preview them and see how it looks like. Just go to the preview button there and you will see exactly how the table is going to look like in your article, which is amazing. Um, here you have the short code for your table. So after you created your table here and you want to insert it in an article, all you need to do is copy that short code here, go into your post and then just paste that short code into your article at the place you would like the table to show up. Which is, okay, let me demonstrate that for a second. I need to save the changes first. Now I'm going to create a new post, posts, add new. That's a little bit slow, I'm sorry.
let's say I have some text here, and then I want to have that table. Um, to do that, oh, I was not in the visual section. Well, this is where you usually will type your article in the visual section here, I'm sorry. And then let's say here I would like to have that table, so all you need to do is like you go to text here, where you have the code that is generated for, for your articles, and you will just insert that um, table press short code like this, that we copied before. Then you save the draft here in the publish section. Now we can preview the post here on view post. There you go. Your table is going to show up here nicely um, with all the data we inputted before and even the search bar is already here. So let's say I'm searching for SDF, which doesn't mean anything of course, and uh, you will find mm, the row where SDF is uh, written. It doesn't work here because, well, it just has four rows, so all the rows are completely visible anyway, so it doesn't really show anything special. But if you have like 500 rows and you search for something like that, it will jump to the right row and show just that. Okay, there you go. Table press, definitely your weapon of choice if you need a nice uh, tables plugin inside of WordPress. You can highly recommend it. It's free. It's just the best out there for sure. And you can customize it fully, you can customize the colors here and there are many other options that I didn't um, explain for the moment but um, everything is very accessible and uh, it's easy to, to find out if you just spend a few minutes on it. So I hope that was helpful and that's it from Mashitoots for today. Have a nice day and see you next time. Bye bye!